Hey, what is up everybody? My name is Rahul and in this video, I'll be discussing about an NFT project that I've been a part of. And yes, some might be wondering that what is the relationship between NFT and cybersecurity because in the end, this is a channel where we discuss about cybersecurity. But I'll be telling you about it and a particular aspect of it where less people are pursuing or focusing at the moment and who knows you might get a head start but before that let me go through the project and let me share with you some of the insights and some of the things that I learned which might help you if you are doing a similar project so the project is called cyber cosmos so it is so the aim or the objective is to bring more females into this industry so uh, we'll be you know generating 10,000 characters of female warriors uh, with the storyline that how they come from another planet to save or to help humanity for, um, for you know fighting the bad hackers so this is just the gist you might you should go ahead and read the story it is a really interesting story so when you are on a live project there are many things that you learn along the way for example communicating with people and I do love communicating with people who are better than me in any domain, be it blockchain, cyber security, development, writing and drawing everything. So I got a lot to learn from artists that we, you know, the artist is from Philippines basically. So I got to interact with him and his skills are really, really good. And you know, because he's the one behind this, so he would be giving us the layers and we would be you know generating 10,000 characters out of those particular layers and you know there are many other things that we learn along the way for example about blockchain because at the end of this it would be a part of the ethereum blockchain we learned about IPFS smart contracts and other things we we, dis we discussed about marketing and other stuff but now comes the part where I would be telling you where I want to focus more in the future and you should too and in a couple of weeks I think I'll be sharing with you a resources about that as well and you know that might help you so you know I, um, people say and I do not know for sure because people have opinions with that NFT and blockchain is, is a part of web3 and smart contracts is a big thing out there so you might have heard of bug bounty but basically if you go for the regular bug bounties like web and other stuff you do not get lot you do not get bounty you, do, you might not get a high price or high bounty but if you try to hunt bugs in the smart contract you might make come a millionaire overnight because the bounties are really really high but that does not mean that it is easy so what i have thought out is that we would be learning about smart contracts and other things in the future and this is one of the main reasons why i like studying about nfts and other stuff because we would be making a smart contract about it and that would be deployed on ethereum blockchain that would be a part of the ethereum blockchain and there has been lots and lots of learnings along the way and hopefully we would you know i would be sharing more stuff on blockchain and uh, and smart contracts in the channel itself that will make you uh, you know become better at it because we are getting into cyber security and basically we are getting into pen testing so pen testing does not stop at web applications we have reverse engineering smart contract hacking and other stuff as well so we would be studying about them in the future as well so thank you guys i hope you like this video